opened in 1993. The National Theatre is 25 years. As part of the anniversary celebration, it's a musical concert by the National Symphony Orchestra, dubbed Tierra Pura, music for orchestra and xylophone. An event featuring a New York City-based composer, percussionist and soloist called Velari Naranjo. Quora Music TV, we are here to get you updated. My name is Max Solofori. executive director of the National Theatre. She's going to tell us uh, something about the anniversary, the 25 years of the facility. You're welcome, Mami. Thank you. Please, uh, your name? Amy Apia from Pong. Okay, so uh, National Theatre is 25 years. What is the line of activities? You are um, about what, my eight, my eight months late. Uh, with this question because we actually started uh, celebrating the 25th anniversary um, on the 30th of last year that was the exact date of the 25th anniversary with a piece uh, that we called Lantaba and we've had um, other activities in between so everything we've done this year it was part of our 25th anniversary celebration for instance on World Theatre Day we performed Marriage of Anansiwa in Nigeria uh, upon an invitation from the Nigerian Performing Arts and Theatre uh, personnel. Then we came back and then in June uh, we had uh, another major production, Agro, which we just finished and this is our next in line. Uh, we also have special editions of, uh, we've had special editions of Concert Party, High Lifetime, uh, the, our usual uh, Ghana Theatre Festival is also going to have a special theme for the 25th anniversary. And then we have a surprise performance to round everything off in December. In December. Okay, so that, that answers my next question of the upcoming event. Uh, quickly, let's talk about some achievements of, uh, since this facility was open. Can you mention one or two to us? I cannot speak about... I can focus on my term here. Exactly. I think that uh, before my term, you all are familiar with some of the programs, Fire World, Kidder Fest, most concert party. So we've had a lot of success. Uh, for students, there's been a lot of outreach to high schools, uh, apart from the ones we do in here. So we've done a lot of outreach events. Uh, I'll say that um, when I came into this position, um, we were sort of in a little bit in rough rot waters because um, the air conditioner wasn't functioning and whatever we did, all everyone did was to talk about the air conditioner. Yeah. Uh, we've managed the air conditioner now and supplemented the uh, central air conditioner with um, some standing air conditioner so that it's more comfortable in the space. Uh, and then, um, so now that we've gone beyond that, now people are focusing actually on the programs that we are having. But we have a regular series. We have the um, High Lifetime that happens the first Friday of every month. We have a concert party, which is still ongoing the second Sunday of every month. We still have Fun World. Uh, we have Slam Ghana, which is especially for high school students and many other programs. Okay, so talking right. of events, what has been the patronage? Is it encouraging? Um, the patronage is a little challenging, um, but um, you, uh, you know, when things die, uh, let me put it this way, I always say that in the beginning, uh, the theatre was new. And when something is new in Ghana, we all know, everybody wants to be part of it. Exactly. 25 years later, you are not new. Sure. So you have to give people a reason to come in here. So it's in all how we position ourselves and how we present and then um, 
uh, peer, basically, uh, because we are no longer who we were at five, but we're 25. Currently, the National Theatre is undergoing a, a strategic plan for the next uh, three to five years, and I, I believe that a lot of you will be pleasantly uh, surprised with what we have to roll out for you. Uh, the first 25 years has actually focused on the National Theatre as a building. But National Theatre is a concept. And uh, you'll be seeing the National Theatre in every corner of the state for the next 25 years. So whether you're in Boko, uh, Hafasni, or uh, uh, Kajebi, look out for National Theatre. There will be a program from the National Theatre. And then when you experience it, I guarantee you, and when you come to Accra, the only thing you want to do is see the building where the work came out of. I have with me the director of the National Symphony Orchestra to explain to us the meaning of the title for tonight's event. You are welcome, sir. Thank you. Please, I would want you to mention your name to us. My name is Isaac Ano, um, the director of the National Symphony Orchestra. Okay, so Tierra Pura, what does it mean? Tierra Pura is a Spanish word. We just chose it. It's one of the piece, title of the pieces of, uh, 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 of tonight's performance. And it means pure land. Ghana is a pure land. Okay. Ghana is a pure land. Talking about Ghana being a pure land, what brought the idea or the concept of tonight's event? Well, National Theatre is 25 years old. Um, next year, God willing, the National Symphony Orchestra will be 60 years old. So it's a double celebration for us. We are celebrating 25 years of cultural elevation or cultural promotion and preservation. And, and so we decided that this evening, the performance we put up is going to be all Ghanaian from the north right to the south. That is the idea for this concert. Okay, so I, I hear we're going to have a combination of orchestra and then xylophone. And I, one would think that that is going to give a superb tune. What do you say about it? Of course, but that's not what, uh, only what you get. Um, with the first part, the program is in two segments. The first segment is just the orchestra will be presenting some Adowa tunes, um, orchestrated. You hear some Bobobo, you hear some High Life, you hear some, you know, Ghanaian tunes. Then we come in with the second uh, 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 part where we feature our guest artists. Okay, so talking of guest artists, what's the name of this guest artist? Valerie Naranjo. She is uh, an American who researched in Ghana on the xylophone. Oh, okay. Okay. So he's been part. She's been part of this uh, family. Sure, sure, sure. Okay. So the uh, National Theatre and then the National Symphony Orchestra. What has been the relation all this while? Well, we are we are we are one of the resident groups of the National Theatre. So that has been uh, is the mother child relationship. That's okay. it. We are here at the National Theatre for the performance from the National Symphony Orchestra as part of the 25th anniversary celebration since the opening of the facility that is the National Theatre. Let's quickly get inside and watch the first part of tonight's event.